Yo guys, I'm going to show you two features here that will help out a lot of the new users to Discord. Um, Because I know we have a bunch of them. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys how to do is how to actually, you know, mute notifications for a specific channel. That, or, that way you don't, you know, receive a bajillion notifications to channels you don't want to receive. It's very simple, very easy. All you want to do is click and hold. I am on mobile. You want to click and hold. And you want to, after you do that, have these four options here. You can hit mute channel, and then these are your options here for 15 minutes, for an hour, for eight hours, 24, or until you turn it back on. I normally do until I turn it back on because I really don't want to receive notifications for that ch chat at all. Um, so, <clears throat> and I'm leaving the tennis one unmuted to show you guys. So if you do have everything else muted here, you can see tennis is highlighted because that's the only one I have un unmuted because that's the one I want to receive notifications for. When it's highlighted, that means someone just typed in there. I can just look. Okay, this is what they say. You can click away from it and it's not highlighted anymore. The second thing I want to show you guys how to do is how to collapse a category to make the Discord look a little bit cleaner, a little bit easier to navigate because I know we offer a lot of options here and it could be very overwhelming. So the first the thing you want to do is um, all you want to do is you just want to hit, as you can see up here next to chat, there's an arrow. It's pointing down right now. If you hit chat, it you know, points towards chat, and that means it collapses the channel. Um, and to uh, you know to to get rid of the collapse, you just, just hit it again, and it'll do that. So, um, the reason these two things are very helpful and can go hand in hand. So right now, as you can see, I have the tennis chat unmuted. Right, if I condense it, this is what it looks like right now. You know, you don't see anything. Um, which is which is perfectly fine because as soon as someone types in that tennis chat, it'll pop up underneath. Just like here in a second, I'm going to show you. Someone just typed, I got the push notification on my phone. Boom, there you go. So it pops up underneath. It's highlighted. That means someone just typed in there. You can click on it. And it's the only chat you see. You can click on it, and you can just go through and see what they say. Okay, then you can go away and, you know, navigate elsewhere. And this works for our cappers, too. So if you don't want to receive notifications for, you know, Brian or Cash and Fats or Kloom or Alan or whatever, it doesn't matter. If you don't want to receive notifications from them, feel free to go ahead and click on their name, you know, mute the channel, and then you can mute it until they turn it back on. And the same thing happens if you collapse the uh, categories here. If you have, let's say you have um, JD unmuted, right? You have JD unmuted, but you have everybody else muted or whatever. As soon as JD posts a play, it's going to pop up like the tennis chat is popping up right now. It's going to pop up under here. It's going to say JD. It's going to have his name highlighted and it's going to have a one next to him because that means he posted a new play. And that goes for every single cap or two. As soon as they post a play, it'll pop up under there. That way it's a little, you know, that way you don't really miss their plays that they post. Because if you have the channels collapse and you see their name under there and it's highlighted, you know, oh, that's something new. I didn't see that before. Perfect example, Nick Carl, you know, Big Dick Nick right there. He just posted a play. It'll pop up under there, and that's how you get the notifications for it. So hopefully this makes you guys' life a little bit easier and makes the Discord a little bit less, you know, confusing. I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.